Welcome back to the Red Carpet Ria, where we bring you the hottest celebrity news and gossip. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you won't miss out on any of our updates. Today we're talking about none other than the legendary Remy Ma and the fiery moment she had during her recent Instagram live session. Plus, we'll look into her and Pat Poose's latest public appearance that's sparking some serious talks. So let's get into it. It all started this Wednesday when Remy Ma was live on Instagram. Out of the blue, a commenter decided to test the waters by claiming Remy looked broke. Well, let's just say, Remy wasn't having it. After blocking the user, Remy didn't just stop there. She made her stance on fighting crystal clear. Remy's unfiltered response quickly went viral, sparking discussions about online confrontations and how celebrities deal with internet trolls. How am I giving broke? Explain, hold on. I'll bring you up, explain to me. Matter of fact, I'm about to screenshot your page. Cause I'm gonna go to your Sorry, I'm a, um. That's it. How about that? How about that? That is like the funniest thing. Like, think I'm saying, all you chat. I'm not broke. Oh my god. Girl, shut up. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Unless you want to fight, huh? Who the? Who want to fight? Nobody. I'm telling y'all right now, I'm never gonna not want to fight. I don't give a fuck if I'm 95 years old, okay? I'm never gonna not want to fight. That's gonna my first resort. I'm gonna always want to resort to violence. Like seriously. Not the screenshot. I tried to screenshot it, but I pressed the wrong button. It's no. I don't be. I don't. Bro, I'm not sitting here arguing. I look at people that argue with people online weird. I want to see you where you at. Pull up. Drop that leg. How about the lights? I'm gonna always want to fight. Just know that I don't care what nobody's saying. Moving on from the fiery live session, Remy and Pat Poose made headlines again last month with their appearance at Pat's 46th birthday party in NYC. <laughs> Mathematics and the change. We're gonna say happy birthday. One, two, three. Happy birthday. Despite the celebrations, the cameras caught something else entirely. Fans were quick to notice Remy's somewhat distant demeanor, fueling speculation about the state of their marriage, especially with ongoing rumors of a breakup. The internet had a lot to say, with comments ranging from concern to outright jokes about their relationship. The situation only got more complicated when allegations surfaced last summer about Remy cheating with battle rapper Easy the Block Captain. According to a leaked audio clip that hit the internet last December, it seems there was more going on behind the scenes. She not in there like, bro, you, bro, you corny and shit, bro. And he corny. And he just corny. So I feel like that, you know what I mean? He deserves some pressure too. I feel like tagging a nigga, yo, Pat, yo, I, yo, I, yo, you since, since real niggas do real things, tag Pat Poo. Yo, are you gonna clear this allegation up or do you want me, or do you want me to? Bro, I will kill that nigga, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, what are you talking about, nigga? I'm not gonna go into y'all personal business because I told her that's what she should do. Like, but I'm putting the pressure on This board. is a better rap traffic school. I'll let that linger out. He don't gotta answer it, but it's gonna linger to the point that they're gonna be expecting me to say something. He need to clear it up or say, no, nigga, I beat you the fuck up or some shit like that. He need to say something. He need to say, it don't, have, I don't, it don't even have to be in my favor. It is in my favor. Because once you say anything that I don't like, then I go live and boom, it's over. Man, listen, she, she said, yo, this is what she, she don't want me to. She don't want me to. No lie. You know what I mean? She's been on my ass, like, asking me, like, please don't do it. I'm like, all right, copy. Let me tell you. But she also said this nigga made the first move. He put you in a fucked up position. So I can't tell you what to do. I'm just asking you, could you do that for me? But I keep saying, but what is he doing? If that's the case, why am I the only person doing something for you? Why he not though? That nigga the one who got 16 then, right? Talking about he held you down from jail. He the one that got 16 years then. Why this nigga not holding you down? 
This is a better rap track exclusive. Like the nigga, all, he could have stopped all of that shit with a tweet. That same night when she made a joint, I made a joint. He could have made a joint. Boom! Anything else that niggas would have read with would have been on them. I wouldn't have had to say nothing. I wouldn't have had to have to force myself to go live. None of that shit, bro. Because everybody spoke already. The fact that she said something, I said something, and you didn't. That make it look weird. The fact that you posted real niggas do real things the next day make it look weird. The fact that you posted a Father's Day picture without her make it look weird. This is a better rap trap exclusive. I can't go live. Speculation. He fucked up. He waiting for this. Yo, he got beat up. Not knowing. Niggas don't really. Niggas starting to try to figure it out. Like, yo, he fucking with Remy. But not knowing that I really. I been with Shorty. And she not. She telling me though. Niggas don't know that she been at my crib since then. And that's what Oz is saying. Oz is like, hey. You the only nigga right now that's sacrificing your career. I mean, she getting killed too. So, but he like. She can just end that shit, but she still, at the end of the day, man, I know what it is. She not saying this is what it is, but I know what it is. She don't want the, she don't want the, what's about to happen. Nigga, the, this little bullshit right now is already hitting her, stressing her out. We like These allegations have definitely shaken up the fan base, leaving many wondering about the future for these two hip-hop powerhouses. So what do you think about Remy Ma's response to the troll? And what about her and Pat Poo's relationship? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. We love hearing from you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content right here on the Red Carpet Re-Up. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.